As you can see on the title, I am going to check out the video from Austin Brown on why he is leaving home free. This should be pretty interesting. Um, as I think, was it Melissa Higgins uh, from Patreon, my suggestion three member, who let me know that he quit it home free um, or he's about to quit home free and was like, oh, I, I was not expecting that at all. Uh, but let's find out why that is. This is not a music reaction per se, of course, but it's about musicians and singers. And this is specifically about Austin Brown, uh, who was like the high tenor member, I should say, probably from um, from Home Free, an a cappella an acapella group, if you don't know them. I mean, who doesn't right here in the live stream? Um, but yeah, we're going to check out why he left Home Free because that came really unexpected uh, to me at least. Um, so we're going to check that out and afterwards we're going to start with your guys' suggestions. And before we do that, let me just take a couple of screenshots um, so that I can um, be sure I can see all your chats afterwards. Okay, guys. Are you ready? Austin Brown on why he left Home Free. Here we go. Well, y'all, here we are. Is it? I think it's a bit silent. Let's put it a bit louder. And let's try again. Oh. Here we go. Well, y'all, here we are. Here we are. It's a brand new day. Is that uh, his it's a wife? Day that, you know, a younger me would have never expected um, to see or find, but we grow, we change, we find um, where, you know, where the universe, where God wants us to be and where we're meant to be. And for me, that is home. Building a family. It's kind of, it's kind of cool. Like he's supposed to be home. He wasn't home free. But now he wants to be home. Okay. This beautiful woman. So yes, I am leaving home free. It is his wife. Um, there are so many comments, so many questions. We're going to do our best to address all of those. Um, we're going to be going live <clears throat> in just a couple days. Check out all of our socials for that so we can really dig into this a bit more. Yeah, and answer all the questions that you guys, I'm sure, have. Absolutely. But we also wanted to come here and just kind of let you hear it from him yeah slash Trick us because i'm here from be transparent i want to say first off that um why in the to say okay <laughs> and now there comes a an advertisement oh my god let me first catch up on the chat whilst that is going on uh yippee i will be watching your reaction on dimash definitely definitely uh i can't wait for tomorrow <laughs> awesome uh, ready anytime always ready that is his wife Amberly yeah, she looks really good uh, it's all I've known Detroit Rock City since 1976 is it worth checking Tommy's version if I'm incredibly tired of that song it will be hard to find a replacement for Austin he has such a signature voice okay um well, uh, Marina, I, I think you can answer the question from that It's All Has. Uh, check it out, because uh, I can't, I, I, I don't know, because I haven't watched or he heard the song, I think. Oh, yeah, there she goes. Trust me, Tommy lifts it up to a completely new level. Okay. We're going to continue here. We're going to continue. Let's keep going. I want to say first off that... Um Everything is wonderful. Everything is is the best it's ever been um, or, or in my life, and I'm so grateful. My heart is so full. I'm so fulfilled on a daily basis. That's good. Um, I've learned so much about myself over the last three, four, or five years, uh, and 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 I have discovered something that I never thought I would want, which is to be home. I never I never knew what home was as a grown man. You mm -hmm. know. We traveled so much and so often, and uh, and then we got a preview, a little peek of home life during COVID, um, and it. Uh, it's funny the the sound of the dog there. I see they have a couple of pets over there, like a cat and the dog. 
he's grunting kind of a bit. <laughs> Let's keep going. From home life during COVID, um, and it uh, it showed me so much. Yeah. And getting back on the road was so much fun, and I'll always love shows. Um, I'll always be in Home Free in my heart, you know. Home Free and I are not done working That's together. Good. Um, That's good. I'm not done with this reminds me. This reminds me a little bit of uh, of uh, Jay Nunn with the voice play, because uh, he quit it because he had to go to the army, I believe it was. Um, but he still does collaborations with them, so we might see Austin in some videos from Home Free. Is what it sounds like to me. So that's good. That's good. Home Free and I are not done working together. Um, I'm not done with acapella. Uh, all of that stuff is, is um, such a part of who I am. The band, my brothers. I love these guys so much. And what's amazing is that they love me too. And we want what's best for all of us. And they know that this is what's best for me. And having their support through this process is something that gives my heart wings. You know, it, it makes me feel like it's what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, internally, within the Home Free band and the entire organization, all I've received um, about uh, this whole grow growing moment has been positive support and love. Yeah. Um, I am, and I'm so grateful mm -hmm. for that because we've been talking about this for a long time. This is not something that happened all at once. You know, I didn't wake Definitely. up last week and go, ah, I want to leave Home Free. That's that's not how this works. You know, no. this is something that we I've been working through in my heart with my therapist with my you know spiritual and and uh, intellectual advisors um for a long time going oh what you know what am i actually searching for what is it that i want and i guess brah, right what is the biggest reason for this moment i want to have a family and i want to be home with my family and and not have to change my life around when that moment comes, you know, good Lord willing, right? Knock on wood, you know, that, uh, that we get to choose that moment. Um, I want to be home and I want to figure out how to have a livelihood just being at home. And that's not in the home free, you know, realm of, of, of how it operates at this point. It's been an incredible run for me. The band is still going to keep going, still going to keep touring. I'm really excited about the process of trying to find somebody, you know, that can replace me. Yeah, and it's not a replacement. It's a new thing, right? They're not going to try and do what I did. Mm -hmm. That'd be dumb, right? Like, that's that's not how this works. We're going to, it's, Home Free is changing and growing. And, you know, if you know anything about me, you know one of my favorite things in the world is change. Yeah. I love it. I thrive on it. I do not. <clears throat> I am not, but I will say too, I think I had, I would be lying if I said that I wasn't shocked and concerned and a little scared when you first kind of started talking about this with me. And mm -hmm. I mean, I would agree. I felt the same way. Yeah, you know, it's, it it's was, like, am I really feeling this way? There was a lot of conversations and, but I do vividly remember the moment that I went, I get it. I really, okay, I get it. And it was when you became just so. I'm going to teach you. This is going to be pretty annoying if it's like full of advertisements. Uh, but I, I get what he's saying so far. Um, and it seems like such a good. Uh, man, and and I hope he's going to be like. I I think they're planning also to to have like a family with kids and such. So so I hope he he can have those kids because I'm I think he'll be a great father. Um, as far as I can hear right now. But let us let us continue. Oh, sorry. There there goes the sound. Here we go. Just so. I mean, just deeply emotional talking about how excited you were to have a Christmas because it's been more than a decade 
that, you know, you guys do Christmas tours every year. And, and they're awesome. The crowds yeah. are amazing. It's so much fun. But your Christmas so much life and season love to everyone. is running in on Christmas Eve and sometimes running out the day after Christmas and then continuing to tour through. Sure. But seeing how emotional you got talking about being able to put up lights and decorate the tree and go drive around and... See mm, all the makes light, sense. Yeah, I just the light things that they do here in Nashville. I want to be home at Christmas. I could, I could almost was, cry thinking about it. But yeah. I'm, I'm gonna keep it together for you guys. That was the Hopefully. moment that I was like. I mean, it doesn't okay. matter to me. Yeah. If, I he, if he gets, sense. if he gets emotional, and so be regardless it. Regardless of how we felt when we first started talking about it, I told you from then, and I truly and genuinely mean it. I will follow you to the ends of the earth. <sighs> Whatever you want to do. I'm here for you. I love you. And he said he's going to keep it together, but I mean, I would I would get emotional just from that alone. We're gonna. There's so much more to this, and to our to what our plans are, yeah. and to all the all that stuff is coming. But right now, it's just about you know connecting with you, the viewer, who's here with us now and is interested in this moment. Like, thank you for joining us on this journey. Um, because we don't know where we're going. We have a lot of plans, but I'm just going to let the universe continue to, to guide me exactly where we are meant to be. Um, but this is my decision, you know. There've been, there's been a little bit of, of kickback, <clears throat> a little bit, and it's to be totally understood. You know, we've, we've been such a fixture for so many people for the last 10 years. And so for me to be leaving that moment, it's, it's sad. It is in so many ways. It's also incredibly hopeful and exciting, but it is sad. And I'm here to honor that. Um, and I want you to know this was, this is my choice. You know, this isn't uh, something, this was never her idea. A. B. I need you guys to respect her and stand up for her. Okay. Because there are so many people and it's, and it's maybe, you know, 5% of, you know, the thousands of people you know, commenting and joining the conversation here. But um, Amberly's not Yoko, and I'm not John Lennon, um, and uh, I'm also not done with Home Free. What, what, did, what did they mean? What did they mean with that? I don't get that. And I'm not John Lennon, um, and uh, I'm not also John not Lennon. done with Home Free. I mean, it's that's just, ob obviously a, a Beatle references, a reference, but... Not John Lennon. Um, and uh, I'm also not done with Home Free. It's just a new moment. It's a new incarnation. We have plans. There will be more music down the line. I will still perform with Home Free upon occasion. But for the moment, I'm going to learn how to be home. You're fine. It's a big, it's a big time for all of us. I've oh, cried a lot emotional. about this. Um, we talked about this with our super fans first last night, and they got to see me not be able to keep it together near as much. Okay. Because it's, uh, it's, it's, you know, change is hard. It's also good, you know, but it is hard. And I'm just here to share with you guys. I want to talk so much more about this, but I'm not going to ramble on because if you know anything about the two of us, we, will talk for we can ramble on. <laughs> um, but again, I think we've decided that on Sunday, February 18th, at 6.30 p.m. Central Time, we're going to go live. We're going to try all the platforms. Sunday, February 18th. So, like, the day after this book was posted, basically, I'd say. We're going to do our best to go on all the platforms. We might even get a buddy to come by and moderate the comments on all yeah. three of them for us, three or four of them. Yeah. I'm not sure how it works, but I, we, I, we've, I've gone live, live on a few. We just, you got to have multiple devices, and it's kind of ridiculous, but, yeah. like... Why not go live everywhere at once? Because we just we we don't we want to talk to you guys about this. I want to share with you all the things that I'm so excited about. The we music that we're scary. excited about. Tim and I have a lot of stuff still planned yeah. together. We actually just got an edit back Good. of a music video that him, myself, and Chatham and Louisa did. Yeah. Um, so there there's gonna be more music. There's gonna be more life. There's gonna be more content. Uh, more vlogs. We're really yeah. digging back into Beating the Bass. We have some big dreams for a wildlife rehabilitation, hospital, sanctuary, center. You know, we've got all kinds of stuff going on, and I'm just excited to be at home and to build something and to, and to have a community, guys, because that's the other thing about touring so much, especially for someone who's socially the way that I am, you know, the way that we are, really. When, when I tour so much, it's hard for me to build a community at home, you know, here mm -hmm. in Nashville. And now that we've been home a little bit more, I'm excited because, like, I'm feeling like 
you know, a person with a, with a tribe again yeah. for the first time in ages. Mm -hmm. And it's, I'm like, oh, wow. I didn't even know I was missing it. But like just being able to go to my buddy's house who's, you know, who lives a couple miles away because I want to and yeah. have the time to, uh -huh. that's so good for my heart. And yeah, so yeah. sometimes a lot of people forget that the 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 life of a of a celebrity and definitely artists touring around and such. You you can you imagine like not even having the freedom to go to just people you know, friends, family, whenever whenever you want. Uh, I mean, of course, like we have our jobs and we have our uh just the things we have to do on a daily basis or on a we or weekly or monthly basis but it's so different when you're on when you have to tour because you, you're just away from home all the time and that's i can i get what he's what he's uh saying here for you guys to see the growth home free's not ending they're only going to become better i'm excited for all the changes the new music that they're going to be doing the new directions as long as 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 well as the old directions all at once um, you know, it, this is a good thing. I promise you, this is what's best for all of us. I know that I, I couldn't continue in that vein and be happy and good to people. So and they it was knew that. And absolutely. They were so yeah, that's a good decision. So generous, and they took their time to really like dive in with Austin on how he was feeling and like what could be done. And it was a long road to reach the point where we are now. It is nothing but good vibes. They are our family. They will continue to be all our family. Forever. And we just wanted y'all to hear that from us. We understand change is hard. We understand that y'all are feeling a lot of different emotions right now. But we wanted to come here and assure you all that this is not the end of Home Free or the end of Austin Brown or the end of the relationship between Home Free and Austin Brown. We are one big happy family and we're going to tell you lots more about that on yeah. Sunday. Yeah. So, so it's also it's all good we'll news. Live. We'll be live, basically. So tune in. We'll we'll send out a link to the email list, you know, or like links or just a reminder. So if you're not signed up for the email list, go to austinbrownmusic.com. Yeah. Sign up for the email list. You know, you will you'll be included in all the announcements to come. Um, there's it's it's a big time, guys. I love you so much. Thank you for tuning in, um, and you know, thank you for your support. Thank you for sticking up for us. You know, for the folks who maybe are a little less understanding yeah. um, of you what we have need to do too. for, you know, our heart. Uh, and that is this moment. Um, I love you. I'm so excited. Thank you. God bless. God bless you too, Austin and uh, Amberly. Um, I think it's it's good that he made a video just for clearance. Uh, and it's mostly probably for those 5% that he mentions um that are not really understanding but yeah you you always have people that are afraid of changes um cuz they're it's what they love home free is what they love they love Austin Brown with home free and of course like if there's a change they 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 are afraid that it's not going to be good enough anymore or something is going to change for the worse but it's not it, like he says, it's going to change for the best. And if he thinks, if he feels that continuing the, sp the path he was on was not going to be where he was going to be happy, then then he should ch make a change. Absolutely. All right. I, I, I'm glad I watched this video too, though. Like, I'm, I'm sure, I was sure he had some good reasoning behind it uh but still it's it's nice to hear it from themselves of course